you know, if that day ever came, because I know Ronda really enjoys wrestling, you know, I mean, wrestling is, we all know it's sport, sports entertainment, but tremendous respect for wrestlers, but these guys do a hundred more shows a year, and can't do nothing but respect them for it. Ronda realizes that, enjoys it, enjoys it, I'm sure the storylines and everything, but Ronda's a real fighter. Right, it's a reality fighter. Ron is the toughest girl I know on the face of the earth. Right. And um, she's going to finish her career in the octagon. And what she does after that, you know, maybe that's an avenue to fulfill a personal uh, bucket list or right. whatever. And if she wants to do it then, I can see it. I, my, per my personal opinion is, um, you know, it wouldn't happen. So right. And you know, this career that she has in movies coming up with the Athena Project and everything working for her, it's like she has so much on the table. Yeah. Ron is the kind of girl that can do a lot of things. Yeah, yeah. But time-wise, she's meant to focus, as she does already, and does very well, uh, on what's But do you think that, I mean, when she does do that, I mean, it will increase her star power if she does it, right? Well, if you did something like that, like a WrestleMania or something, like right. one of those bits, like Floyd Mayweather's done, right. um, obviously then the fans of the, of the uh, of, you know, wrestling, that right. are, are they're not fans of mixed martial arts in the UFC are obviously going to transition over, kind of like what Brock Lesnar did. Right. Uh, when he brought a tremendous amount of fans over with him, initially it became into the Octagon. So, right. you know, in business there's a thing called cross promotion, and it's always a good thing. But it's the right thing, and that's what you got to That's what's going on. What's your name, and uh, why should people choose the Gardens at uh, Park Baboa? Yeah, hello, my name's Jonathan McFaul. I'm the Community Triple H Director here at the Gardens at Park Balboa. Let me first say and welcome you to our community here. Um, one of the few reasons why you should choose us, um, we're one of the few family-owned and operated assisted living communities left in the industry. It's kind of a nominally to have that. Um, our community features beautiful garden areas, beautiful outdoor areas, a great robust activity programming from painting classes, jewelry classes, live entertainment, just to name a few, and of course, a compassionate care staff that will take care of your loved one. Um, we'd, I'd love to tell you more about our community, show you around. You can give us a call at 818 787 0462. Do you have a social media by any chance? Um, yes, we have a social media, uh, Facebook, The Gardens of Park Balboa, and Instagram at The Gardens of Park Balboa as well too. Thanks so much, sir. Thank you.